Hello and welcome back to Focus Atlanta again. I am your host, Keisha Lancelin. Thanks so much for tuning in with us this Sunday afternoon. In this segment, we're going to talk a little bit about gut health and how perhaps we can be doing a little better. I'm here with Dr. Villanueva. Thanks so much for coming on the show. Oh, it's so good to see you. It's so good to be here today. I got to say, people often feel like with gut issues, there's really no help. Like there's nothing that we can do. What are you telling the people, the, the patients that you work with? Well, you know what? It's very interesting that when we are talking about um, not only gut issues, but just chronic disease across the board and chronic illness, chronic symptoms, meaning that you've had these issues for more than two years, um, Interestingly enough, the Western medical model has no cures and no solutions for these types of things. This is why over the last 30 years, we've seen a stark increase instead of a decrease. We've seen a stark increase in chronic gut issues, chronic autoimmune issues, and just chronic disease across the board. The good news is that in alternative, holistic, or functional medicine, they're all interchangeable terms, um, there are cures, so to speak. There are the answers and solutions to actually reverse these types of issues and conditions that the Western traditional medical model still to this day has no answers for. What do you say to a patient who is difficult to broach the topic with their traditional physician? You know, often they may read something about a holistic treatment or they may see something or, or a friend has tried something, but they don't really know how to bring it up with their doctor. They don't want to offend them, but they do want to integrate some new things into their treatment. How, how do you get them to make that first step? That's such a great question. Um, you know, first of all, ask, remember that it's your health and it's your body and you have autonomy over your health and your body. And if you're trying something and it's not working and you've given it a good shot a year, maybe two years and you're worse than when you started, you know, talk to your doctor about it. Say, hey, you know, I'm interested in trying a holistic approach and I have found a holistic practitioner who can help me. And you know what? I mean, wouldn't you think from your own perspective, if they can't figure it out, that they would be open to, well, you know what? I haven't been able to figure this out. Go ahead and try it and let's see what happens. And you know, the reality is that there are many practitioners out there, many doctors who are are open to it um, and then there are some who just are not for whatever personal reasons or ego issues that they have and so we just have to take the power back into our own hands and really come back and think about it like okay I've given this a try for two years I'm worse than I was before I'm gonna go try something whether my doctor likes it or not so I you know I think ultimately it's really great when the practitioner is open to it, especially if they haven't been able to fix the issue themselves. Um, but if they're not, we just need to remember that it's our body and it's our choice. Often I think that people are afraid to take that first step to a holistic treatment or to a holistic physician because they don't know very many. They don't know anyone specifically who has worked with someone. And, and again, they don't know what that relationship might look like with their traditional physician and can they do both and should they have both? Um, are those type of questions, you know, are those type of things that you get questions about often? Um, sure we do. You know, we'll get questions. The good news is that holistic care and holistic services um, have grown colossally in the last decade. And there are holistic doctors all over Atlanta. There are holistic doctors all over, you know, the entire state of Georgia. In fact, they're all over the United States. And so all one needs to do nowadays is just simply go online um, and look and I promise you that, you know, you will find good ones out there. You know, we we actually took ours. We were a brick and mortar in Austin, Texas. I actually did live in Atlanta for a while. I, I love Atlanta. You know, hello to all of my Georgians. Um, that is a second home for me. I absolutely love Georgia and I love Atlanta. It's one of the most beautiful cities I've ever lived in. Um, but we had a brick and mortar, we had an office. And back in 2018, um, you know, we had many people from around the country reaching out to us and flying in to see us. We actually changed our model from a doctor patient model to a um, holistic educational and coaching model. And we see people in over 18 countries. We have 
we have clients in Georgia, we have clients in California, we have them all over the United States, um, as well as outside of the U.S. And so, really, you know, for those who are listening, who have been lo who've been struggling with chronic GI issues, look for somebody local. That's always fun because then you get to drive and do the local office, and you get to, you know, sit in front of them and have that face to face. But you know, also know that there are models out there like ours that are online, and and if you don't want to drive in traffic and you don't want to you know and and that doesn't matter to you and you want to do it in on a zoom call you can do that too thank you so much for coming on the show thank you for sharing this education thank you for giving us options it was a pleasure to meet you it was so good to meet you too all right guys there is something that you can do you don't just have to suffer in silence there may be an alternative or a holistic option please take opportunity to learn more and stay tuned to more focus atlanta we'll be right back